MBTA is making changes as more people get back to work. Anna Myler is at the Ashmonte station with the reopening details, Anna. Brianna, the MBTA is expanding service for trains, buses, and ferries, and they're also launching a new campaign called Ride Safer, which includes handing out masks at some of the busier stations like Ashmont here in Dorchester. MBTA General Manager Steve Poftak was here this morning to talk about the new campaign, which includes posters promoting face coverings, social distancing, and good hygiene, handing out masks during peak hours to those who need one for the next two weeks, and launching a new site to give riders a behind-the-scenes look at how they're cleaning and disinfecting the vehicles and stations. This campaign coincides with the start of expanded service on the MBTA. Starting today, they are increasing service on nearly 60 bus routes. They're resuming regular weekday service on all subway lines. They're essentially doubling service on the commuter rail, and there will be limited weekday ferry service to Hingham and Hull and Charlestown. We expect that this will be a slow return to work. Right now, we believe that we have a, a, a really extraordinary amount of service available so that people can ride in a socially distanced way. Right now, we're running so much service. We're running essentially 100% of service for, at least on the red line, roughly 15 or 16% of the ridership. So we think we've got plenty of service out there so that people, we should be able to handle any of uh, any any demand we, we, we hit. And MBTA General Manager Steve Poftak says they have tested about 1,000 employees for the coronavirus. Currently, there are more than 20 who have tested positive and are out on leave. Reporting live in Dorchester, Anna Myler, CBSN, Boston.